Hello guys, my name is Vijay Kumar Vaka. I am working as Senior Solution Consultant in Episero. In this session, let us discuss about how to create multiple environments in AnyPoint platform. So let me log into my AnyPoint platform. This is the trial account, guys. Now, as soon as you log in, right, uh, if you check in the Runtime Manager, uh, we'll see uh, two environments. One is Design, the other is Sandbox. So if you want to check what are all the environments that are available within the, our AnyPoint platform, right? Go to Access Management. And here you can see, and if you click on Environments, you'll be able to see the available environments. So by default, we have Design and Sandbox, and this is these are the two environments that will come with the trial account. Okay. Now, if if I want to create more accounts, right? We can create more accounts in trial account as well. So for that, you, you can click on add enrollment and just uh, name uh, your enrollment. Suppose dev is a, dev is another enrollment, for example, and choose sandbox. Why we have to choose sandbox? I'll let you know. Just click on create. So now three enrollments we could see. Now let's add one more environment as prod and click on sandbox and click on create. So this way we are able to create uh, four environments. So let's rename this as dev, sorry, test environment because we have already created dev environment, right? So click on update. Now total we have uh, four environments. Um, so if you go back to the runtime manager, right here, now you will be able to see all the four environments in the runtime manager, design, dev, prod, test. Okay. So let me switch to dev environment. And uh, let's try to deploy a mule application. So I'll be deploying in cloud hub 1.0. Let me name it as sample mule. API and click on upload file deploy application now this application will will be deployed in dev environment okay for example uh, sorry I need to go to access management So why we have to create uh, all these environments, right, uh, as sandbox? So it's a dev environment, prod or test, but it is of type sandbox. You could see type here, sandbox. Now, now why we have to create it? Uh, if you go to subscription and runtime manager, right? If you see sandbox, environment of type sandbox is having one v core. So in trial account, you'll get one week or of uh, sandbox and one week or of design as well. So that means whatever the new en environments that you are going to create, they should be of type sandbox or design. But design is um, most probably uh, for uh, design center. So we can utilize these sandboxes and uh, we can create multiple environments by using the sandboxes uh, type. So you, you can create one more environment as well, but you will have one week or only for all the new environments of type sandbox because the memory, whatever the tri trial account has given to us, right? The number of week or it won't change. Okay. So now let's say if I'm going to create uh, one more environment of type production, let's see what happens. So click on add environment. Um, I'll create something like prod2 and of type production. Okay, so let's create that. It will get created here, prod2. But if you go to the runtime manager, right, it will be even shown in the runtime manager environment section. If you click on this, you'll see prod2 is there. If I go back to the prod2, click on switch. And if, if I deploy the application, right, it won't get deployed. So let me try that. 
let me deploy in cloud of 1.0 I'll name it as um, let's say 2 for example okay now if you see here right your application will not run due to weak or availability so even though if you deploy right it won't work <coughs> it won't see we got an error message the maximum number of live production applications has been some error uh, we got right because we have created prod to environment but it is of type production and by default we we got a uh, weaker's availability only for sandbox and design types of uh, environments okay so that is why you you have to create your environments uh, of type sandbox only so this is what i wanted to cover uh, in this session thank you